Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 31st of December 1935, the board game Monopoly was patented. Although the patent for the game was awarded to Charles B. Darrow, a Philadelphia heating salesman who had lost his job during the Great Depression, it's now widely recognised that Darrow was just one of many people who led to the development of the complex design and rules that we now know as Monopoly. As early as 1902, an Illinois-born writer and engineer called Lizzie Maggi created a board game that she referred to as the Landlord's Game, and which bore striking similarities to the later Monopoly. She patented this game in 1904 and approached Parker Brothers with the idea in around 1910. Although that board game manufacturer declined to publish it, her self-produced copies became popular with Quakers, university students and members of the public who supported Georgist economics. Meiji, by now married and with the new name Phillips, repatented an updated version of the game in 1924, when she was again turned down by Parker Brothers. However, the updated version spread widely through word of mouth, and Charles Darrow's wife eventually learned about it. Darrow began to copy and distribute his own version of the game and in October 1934 was himself rejected by Parker Brothers who found his game too complicated, too technical and that it took too long to play. However, successful Christmas sales of Darrow's game led Parker Brothers to reverse their decision and bought the game from Darrow in March 1935. Before the end of the year, they learned that he was not the sole inventor, but they pressed ahead with the purchase and helped him to secure a patent, while they bought up the patents to similar games, including the Landlord's Game, to ensure that they had definitive ownership of the whole idea. <laughs> 